In this video, I'm going to show you how to download Zscaler on PC. Take note that I can't show you how to download it because it needs to be provided by an organization, school, or company. So, I'm going to walk you through the process of installing Zscaler on your PC. So, in here on Zscaler, you'll need an account provided by your organization because Zscaler is a secure service that requires specific credentials to use. So, if you don't have access, please reach out to your IT department or system administrator. Now, assuming you have the download link, let's talk about how to install it. So, you'll need to listen very carefully. So, first, download the Zscaler client connector installer file from the link provided by your organization or your IT department. Second, once you download it, you'll find the installer file on your download folder on your uh, file manager. So, it should be like Zscaler client connector setup.exe and now double click on the file and begin the installation. And after that, follow the on-screen instructions, accept the license agreement, and select your installation preferences. And then click install and wait for the process to complete. After installation, you'll open the Zscaler Client Connector app. And here's what you'll typically do next. First, you'll be prompted to log in using the credential provided by your organization or school. And second, once you enter your username and password Zscaler, will automatically configure and connect to the secure service. And third, from here, you'll be able to enjoy the security and protection Zscaler offers. And that's the general process for installing and setting up Zscaler. Keep in mind that Zscaler is a secure service that's specifically managed by your organization, so you won't be able to access it on your own. And that's how you download Zscaler on your PC. So if you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the YouTube channel.